Pamela, integrating modeling and machine learning for autonomous robotics. Machine learning is rapidly advancing the decision-making capabilities of computers, yet with an in-depth knowledge of programming and modeling, many researchers find current technology inaccessible. The lack of an appropriate modeling language has forced researchers to make do with simple models, limiting advances in machine learning and autonomous robotics. Now Dr. Paul Robertson at Dynamic Object Language Labs believes that a solution has been hiding in plain sight, machine learning itself. To sidestep the need to manually build models and write programs that link them with modeling languages, his team has created a new language and tool chain that can build models themselves using only sensor data. Named Pamela, the team's new modeling language is designed to work alongside machine learning in the real world. Using Pamela, the possible outcomes for each variable in a model and their probabilities can be modeled autonomously. This means that models themselves can be learned and the learned models can change as learning makes them more reliable. To apply Pamela to real-world situations, Dr. Robertson developed the Pamela Autonomy Toolchain, or PAT. To understand how it works, take a simple problem in which a robot has low battery and must find a charging point. The charging point is locked, however, and the robot must first find the key. To achieve this goal, PAT first builds a five-stage plan. Go to the key, take the key, go to the charger, insert the key, start charging. To enact these steps, several parameters must be set out in a model of the situation. For example, in order to use the key, the robot must first be holding it, and in order to pick it up, the robot must be close to it. With machine learning, the physical actions associated with each parameter can be learned through experience. However, through previous approaches, researchers needed to establish the instructions themselves. With PAT, the probabilities of the variables measured by the robot's sensors can be used as the variables required to build a model of the situation with no human input required. The key to unlock the charging point could be anywhere in the room. A plan that covers every possibility of where the key might be would be very complex. In this kind of situation, the robot needs to take actions to improve its knowledge about the world, and it also needs to take actions to complete its mission. This can be done through PAT, which establishes a set of beliefs about the actions a system must undertake to realize the parameters of its plan by assigning higher or lower probabilities to them. Therefore, the robot learns to look around the room in order to improve its belief state, allowing it to assign higher probabilities to the key being in particular areas. In future runs, the robot will believe more strongly that the key will be in a similar area to where it was before, reducing the need for planning. Ultimately, this equates to a more reliable model of the situation than a researcher could ever build. Having established a framework for Pamela, Dr. Robertson's team is now encouraging the programming community to make their own contributions to the language. Since Pamela is available as open-source software, the team hopes that its capabilities will quickly evolve through the inputs of specialists around the world. This could bring about new machine learning algorithms, better planning systems, and new systems for diagnosing problems when plans are derailed.